So this video, we use the Cold War AK-47 along with the Meta OTS-9 to drop a solid gameplay inside Warzone. If you enjoy epic comparisons and gameplay videos like this, don't forget to subscribe to the channel as we try to reach our goal of 10,000 subscribers and click that link in the description down below and subscribe to our second channel. We'll be posting tons of Vanguard multiplayer content on that channel when the game releases and this channel is going to mainly focus on Warzone. So before we get into the class setup of both of these guns because I make some slight changes to what the usual builds are and I just want to let you know in this gameplay you'll see me supporting my teammates a ton with assists. You'll see a lot of me shooting enemies, breaking armor and then not actually getting the kill in the end for it because my teammates take the kills and sometimes it's just not your game to get all the kills and that's absolutely fine. There's no need to complain about that. Like I said, that happens sometimes. Sometimes you get all the kills, sometimes you don't. But like I said, I support my teammates a lot and I just wanted to let everyone know that it's okay to do that. And this is not like a support loadout or anything like that. You don't need to build weapons specifically to support teammates. It's just something that should be ingrained in your overall gameplay anyways. So let's get on into the class setup now. So for the Cold War AK, I did use the kind of standard build for this weapon. So we use the GRU suppressor for the sound suppression, recoil control, bullet velocity and damage range. For the barrel, we use the Spetsnaz RPK barrel. This controls the recoil as best as possible for the Cold War AK. This gun has now become one of the more lower recoil weapons in the game because every other gun has tons of recoil now. Then we used the Spetsnaz grip for the best recoil control. Then I did use the 45 round mags. In some cases, to be completely honest, I wish I did use the 60 round mags, but I just don't want to hinder my ADS way too much. So I still went for the 45 round mags in this gameplay because movement is still pretty important to me. And then the optic, I went for the Axio 3x optic. That's my favorite optic to use, but you can use whatever you like in this case. Then for the OTS-9, I did switch this up a little bit. For the barrel, we did use the Task Force Barrel, and that's for the effective damage range and mainly the strafing speeds. You do get bullet velocity bonuses as well. This is the best close range SMG in the game right now, let's be completely honest. Nothing really competes with the OTS right now. Then I did use the VDV 40 round fast mags. It's still the best mags for the OTS, even though it did get a little bit of a nerf earlier on. Then for the stock, I still use the skeletal stock. People tend to not use a stock on this weapon or use a Spetsnaz, but I like the skeletal stock. I think it's the best for me. Then the rear grip, I do use the serpent wrap for the faster aim down sight time. But what I did change was instead of using the GRU suppressor, which is what I usually use, I actually started using the sound suppressor. I don't really need the extra damage range out of the suppressor there because the range on this gun is not the best anyway. And boosting that out an extra 10% is going to be like one meter, which is not going to make too much of a difference. But what I do think is going to be beneficial is that faster aim down sight time and more importantly, the faster sprint to fire time, which allow you to hit fire a little bit easier because your gun gets down a little bit quicker. Then for perks, we're using EOD, Overkill and Amp, Semtex and Stun Grenades. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave it a like. No, man, how did that guy not die? Enemy precision airstrike. What? Where the fuck did everybody go? No. They're not on the roof? I think there's one more. Yeah, because you got the team wiping that bitch shot. Yeah, I mean, that's 69, motherfucker. Where do you go, bro? Yeah, go on, go on, go on, go on. Oh, it's full team, full team, full team. Yeah, yeah, feel, uh, I do have loadouts, I think. Yeah, yeah, feel team. Move us on it. Got one. Oh, 
No more, there's more, there's more. Second tank. story. Oh shit, on the roof. What an idea. Oh shit! He's upstairs. Airstrike. Nice, nice, nice. There's guys sniping like over here somewhere. Marking waypoint coordinates, setting red point. Cancel, cancel. I might get these guys shot. I might get these shot. Twenty five remaining, nicely done. That's nine rambles part. Gas is moving in. New safe zone located. Yeah. yeah, how do we want to rotate this? Um. Guy with a sniper in here. Marking waypoint coordinates. 
Uh, orange one. Like all the way to the right? Yeah. He's in that building. Destination box. He just dropped in front of you, ran to your left. Unless. Right above you, ran. Two of them. Down one of them. Down. Yeah, I got no armor. Oh my god, I tagged them once. Bitches are about to catch Oh my god, once. Oh. Oh, down one on the roof? He's right there on the ladder. There's two of them on the other side. I've down one on the roof. Two guys on me. Right there. I got one of them. There's another one. You ready, Spark, to go? Be you advised. can push it. I'm Friendly position. Position. Strike inbound. There's two guys on me. I'm dead, man. I'm hit. I'm fucking hit. You got your puzzle on kind of left. Towards the start. There's just still 11 guys left, man. No, no, let me move, please, please, please. I've got self-raise, I've got self-raise, I've got self-raise. No, I've got self-raise, I've got self-raise! No! Why? Nice. 